Marapeng is actually one of the few places where we find uh, an early Stone Age assemblage or an early Stone Age collection of stone tools and it's not in a cave. So most of the early Stone Age tools we find around the cradle of humankind are all in caves which are very difficult to excavate and very difficult to get to. And these are quite nice because they're so close to the surface. So we can excavate them using very uh, conventional methods and we can get students to help us. So we can build up a very nice collection very quickly. Um, this stuff, these tools are classed as early Achillean, which means they, they look like they're about 1.5 to 1 million years old, uh, which is very old. And, and we think the most likely hominid uh, to, to produce these tools was a guy called Homo ergaster. Uh, and we don't really know because we very rarely find bone and stone tool in the same place. Mostly used, most of the tools are, are very big, although lots of the things we find here are very small because they've been broken while they're, while they're being transported. But lots of the tools are sort of large things that they would use to bash to get into bone or to process wood or to, to do other things uh, that are heavy duty. So there wouldn't have been lots of little things that they would have cut or they didn't have the ability to, to put things onto spears and, and arrows and things but they would have run around and mostly been scavenging with big tools that would bash to, to get into bones and to carcasses. So.